There we go. Nice. Welcome back, Mech Warriors. This is Old Bob 10025 with the Marauder. They have the R and the other ones. Let's go see which ones they are. I am so excited about this. They got the D and the M. I didn't get the other package because I filled to basically the 30%. I'm okay. I have enough C bills and everything else. I'm good on that. But let me tell you, man, I'm so excited about this. Give you, a, I'm gonna give you a, a kind of like review of my own different thing about it. I'm gonna do some gameplay, and then we'll go from there, like pretty much. Basically, like I bought it with the extra, um, um, the month that it came out, you get 6.5 million like extra C bills. You get a whole bunch of other different like modules and everything else, um, hanging items and everything else. I'll try to go find those in, in there as well. But I'm just so excited about this; it's incredible. Uh, finally, they came back with the old, old stuff, the stuff that was um, banned by Carl Maycheck and Robotech, and just, this, this is cool, this is great. Okay, so you got the Mad 3R, the Mad 5D, and the Mad 5M. Now, basically, go through the quirks real quick and show you what their quirks are. <clears throat> Excuse me. The Ballistic Range, plus 10, um, the Velocity, 10%, Energy, Heat Generation, negative 5, PPC, Velocity, plus 50. That is freaking awesome. But you have to use the PPC, though, which kind of sucks. Um, uh, you know, especially for the um, um, for the Inner Sphere, it sucks because you can't fire within, I believe, 90. Uh, the Heat Generation, um, PPC, Heat Generation, negative 5%. This does come with two medium lasers, two PPCs, and an AC-5. This is the standard one. The standard generation, um, the first one you get, pretty much it has no bonuses, no extras, and, and nothing else for it. Give you an example. Uh, let's go to loadout like real quick. I'll go to loadout. I'll go to expand a view. It would be a lot better. <clears throat> Obviously, the arms, and, um, the arms have the PPCs and the two medium lasers and then AC-5 there with only one ton of ammo, which is kind of weird. Basically, one thing that I would do with this is change out your engine. Uh, to an, to probably no actually I'll probably keep the uh, probably keep that you go with 64 not too bad uh, definitely double up the heat sinks if you can that's 1.5 million to go and do the armor change that up and and change it up uh, for the for the endo steel that way you get a little bit more armor because you're noticing the armor is actually less 14 there for 28 available to you know I mean you you have to max out this stuff with the ferro fibers and the endo steel you definitely max it out max out your armor and then change out maybe the medium lasers to medium pulse lasers if you can uh, keep the PPCs because you want those quirks involved into it uh, this is the 3R this is a standard one maybe the AC5 you can probably get another ton of ammo because that's only what 30 rounds yeah 30 rounds there definitely get uh, definitely get more ammo for that because I know people like to shoot a lot and you gotta go do that let's go to the other ones Weapon grouping, obviously it's going to be PPC, tumor lasers, and AC-5. Camo specs, I just, um, it has a polygon, a polygon like Marauder, which, which looks like this, and you can change it out to whatever you want to. Next one, you go down. I mean, it's kind of cool, like, the different things you can do with it. It's just, I mean, like, I got a couple examples that I'll, that I'll be using, but still, cockpit items, go see if we can find those. Hopefully they actually come up. Ooh -hoo -hoo. This is a new one, too. This is also... This is new too, as far as the uh, as far as what you can be having. So let's go see what this looks like. You can actually see what it looks like. That's not bad. I like that. And also too, it's a lot easier to figure out which ones you have instead of going through that stupid freaking process of trying to figure out which ones you have. So let's put a Davion banner up there. I like that. Davion hologram. I gotta get one of those sometime. There's only five hundred. Definitely get one of those. Davion pie, as as you can tell. Go down, go down, go down, go down. I knew it come with something though. I think it's hanging. I think it's a a hanging item that came with. But I mean, generally, I mean, look at this. You could actually preview stuff a lot better system to preview everything about it. Uh, Interstellar two could defeat. Yes, we lost. I know, I know. <clears throat> Excuse my my uh, voice here. It's kind of kind of hoarse there. Um, just kind of kind of cold where I'm at, so my voice is kind of getting there. But let's see. Um, oscillating fan. <laughs> nice, nice. Phoenix standing item. This is one of the items that, that does come with it. Let's go to hanging uh, items. Preview, come on. Hanging. Okay. Preview. Ooh, that's kind of cool. Oh, huh, that's kind of neat. Looks like they didn't actually, um, you can't go to the other ones for some reason. Okay, here we go. Hang, hanging items. That's how you get to it. So, go up here, go to hanging items, and go from there, like, pretty much. C-Bill Medallion. Of course, uh, when you spend a lot of money, I guess you get one of those. 
I definitely spent some money, which I shouldn't have, but I did. But, you know, the game's worth it, I think. The game's definitely, like, worth it. Okay, let's go to the other items that are here. Phoenix with Amber. There we go. Oh, that's kind of cool. Uh, goes around. Mounted items. Goes down to... Now, they said you could actually test out the horns. So let's go test them out and see what they sound like. i put my headphones real quick. Here we go. Oh, that's cool. So you test out the horns. Oh, nice. Classic war horn. Classic. That is cool. Jay Falcon war horn. You can test these out. Oh, that is freaking cool. I love that. <laughs> Karita war horn. That makes it so much better. Now, I actually, I want to go spend money on, on some horns. Here we go. Here's a Phoenix war horn, which comes with the package. Hey, it could have been better, but, you know, hey, what are you, a uh, rec room speaker? <laughs> Resistance to Warhorn. I like that one. That's kind of cool. Screaming Surrette. Okay, that's kind of weird. Sonic Boom. Okay, anyways, those are the, uh, um, those are the standing items and everything else that comes, that comes with it, the three different Phoenix things. So you can preview them. Preview this one. That looks like that. And then preview the Sonic Boom. That's cool. I like that. That's not bad at all. Okay, so let's go back. I'll go back to the, let's go back to, to the other ones. So I'm going to go through the 5D now. The 5D is this one here. Kind of, um, don't want to, uh, yep, I want to not load up that stuff because I want to spend 750. So let's see here. I uh, went ahead. Here we go. Okay, let's go to loadout. Let's see what the loadout is. Okay, loadout. Let's go to actually. Let's go see what the. Uh, okay, so torso rate uh, plus thirty five, energy heat generation negative ten, missile velocity plus ten, missile cooldown plus twenty. So obviously this will have some missiles to it. So it looks like where would the missiles be? Actually, I'm thinking uh, where would they be? I don't know. That's weird. I have to check it out. The uh, check out the loadout here. PPC ER PPC. Mini pulse laser, ERPPC, mini pulse lasers in the arms, jump jets, which is kind of cool. Large pulse laser. Oh, streaks. Okay, streak two. I would probably take that out and get something else. I mean, streak two is kind of cool, but probably go with the streak four, streak six. Maybe upgrade. Um, you got double heat sinks, which is nice. And XL300, which is beautiful. It goes uh, 64. Yeah, it goes 64. Then you got to uh, go with the Indo Steel if you can. Let's see how many uh, stuff they have here. Yeah, so, I mean, it's not bad per se, but I would do some other modifications. The armor seems to be maxed out, which is nice. So, it's 64 legs, 48 right and left torso, arms are 48. Not bad. Not bad at all. Very fibrous. And, yeah, so, I mean, yeah, that's not that's not bad with, with heat sinks. Not bad at all. Let's go to the 5M. Let's see. 5M looks like it has an LB10X on top here. Let's go check it out here. Check out the quirks for this. Quirks are energy heat generation negative five, and laser duration negative ten percent. Turn rate pretty good. Additional structure that's not, that's not bad at all. Comes with large pulse, two large pulse lasers, which is really good. So it's a pulse laser mech. That's not bad at all. And the LB10X AC. I love the LB10X. Very very nice. The ballistic is two energy five. Probably I'm gonna see a lot of laser vomit with this one. With the 5D, I will see a lot of laser vomit. And with the uh, that one, a lot of ballistic vomit. Yeah, that's probably what I'll, I'll be seeing like on these mechs. But let's go with the 5M. Go see what that looks like on the inside. It'll be 10X on the right torso. Because that's where you got that. Uh, ammo. I would definitely go with more ammo. They also increased the ammo from 15 to 20 for the LB 10 x Which is one of the better things out there. Uh, large pulse laser, large pulse laser. It's not much you can really do to this per se. But I'll probably lose the two jump jets and get some extra... Each one of these is one ton. Yeah. Get two more tons of armor and actually just max out the stuff if you can. That's what I would do. Um, definitely put your heat generation. If you got any large pulse laser uh, modules, meaning pulse laser modules as well, definitely use those. It did come with a PPC module and a, um, let's see what else it came with. It came with a, over here real quick. Let's get out of this. Um, mech modules. Consumables. Let's go to mech modules. Owned. Did come with a... 
target info gathering, which I don't have um, memorized yet, so I'll probably use my points for that just to get that. So let's see, a decreased amount of time required for detailed target information by 25%. Really nice. That's not bad. That's really good for uh, for LRMX uh, um, if you have that. Thank God I'll probably use it on my, on my LBX4J, but they did nerf that. They did nerf some mechs. Um, <coughs> Excuse me. The uh, the Gauss rifle did get nerfed as far as the charging rate. The uh, um, the four the 100 pack 4J did get nerfed as well. I'll show you that if I can. Let's see, go to medium. 4J. Here we go. 4J. Let's see what the quirks are for this now. Uh, missile generation. LBX 10 uh, cooldown plus 15 percent and. Missile cooldown plus 20, so 35 percent. It dropped 15 percent, which kind of sucks. But I kind of saw the nerf on that because I did a review on the 4J on my um, on my YouTube channel as well for that, and I was knocking out missiles at 50 percent like crazy. But I'll probably just buy a module for that a LRM10 and kind of just keep it at 50 percent and still do the same thing. So it's not too bad, not too bad, uh, not too bad a nerf. They did nerf a couple things. I'll go over that later on in another video about the patch and what they did, what they didn't do, what they should have done. But it just lets you know about the mechs here. The uh, oh god, I cannot wait to use these. I will be doing another um, at, right after this. I'll be doing a gameplay like video of this as well. So they got the R, D, and M, and then also the the champion mech and the hero mech that that you can get if you spent the forty and uh, the fifty five dollars for it. So just let you know about these guys. Really appreciate you watching. I know if you watch other YouTubers, appreciate you watching mine. And uh, PPC. This one, I'm probably going to max out a little different things. I'm going to modify this. Might make this a missile mech. It has two missiles. Get some LR and 10s or 20s or something like that. Be kind of nice. Cooldown is 20%. So if I buy a module, uh, that'll be another 12%. So I'll probably knock it up to 32% for LRM 10, for two LRM 10. So it wouldn't be too bad. Maybe take out the um, large pulse laser. Mm, something like that. I got to figure it out first. And then. The, uh, the 5M like how you have the engines that's kind of cool but anyways I'll be right after this going to do a gameplay video and I will see you on the battlefield thank you for watching okay let's see how many uh, pilots are out there yeah it looks like one <laughs> two three four I got four so far good luck everybody let's have a good time man so let's see yeah wow cannot wait for this this is going to be awesome Yeah, so it's the first time using it, so bear with me on my gameplay and all this kind of stuff. I don't know how this how, how this can work. I know from the side, it's going to take a lot of damage on the arms and the right and left torsos. The head might be hit a little bit more, but it just all depends, though, depending on uh, what's, uh, you know, how you're facing them. I would probably suggest hitting them at an angle if you can. That way, basically, uh, the, the legs have 65, so if they're going to shoot your legs out, they're going to have a hard time at it. So let's get going. Oh my god, they added that too. If you notice, let's see if I can get it though. I can't. I, I, in fact, I have it for something else. But they added the control cockpit, so now those blank screens, screens actually do something. So that is freaking cool. So I can go right in front of this guy. Okay, the turn rate's not too bad. I kind of like it. <clears throat> okay, I. Uh, I might have to stagger the PPCs, which I probably will. Yeah, I'm gonna have to stagger those. That's okay. It's not a bad deal. Okay, I'm gonna go back this way here. Wow, that is really, really nice. Okay, let's go see here. <clears throat> Excuse my, uh, I got a frog in my throat pretty much. Here goes the other one. And he might be AFK, so who knows. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Look at that. Gorgeous. Oh, bored to death. I'm going to go ahead and hide behind this guy here. But if you notice, like, the, the cockpit controls, those blank little screens are done now. So you actually have something going, which which kind of pissed me off. They really didn't do anything for it. But I do hope that they, uh, they have a kill count on the right side over right above the weapon right above the weapon control. Let's see if I can. Very, very fast. Fast load out there. Acquired. I only got 60 rounds for my AC, so I can't be using that. New target acquired. <laughs> I 
think Marauders should stick together here. I like his design. He must have a, a champion one. New target acquired. I guess we're gonna hang out here. Target destroyed. Here we go. New target acquired. Wow, that went by quick. Okay, I think probably the ERPPCs are gonna be a problem. I'll have to redo the heat system on this, but that's okay. That's all right. Not a not a bad deal. Not not bad at all. Okay, I gotta hide here real quick. I don't know why people freak out over missiles. Missile. Looks like I'm tar I'm tagged. Yeah, I'm tagged. Just gonna hit here real quick. They have. I do have my arms locked, unfortunately. Good, good, good. Okay, I'm gonna go forward now. Start New engaging. Acquired. Nice. This is gorgeous. I'm very happy about this. <clears throat> New target acquired. Yeah, the overheating is gonna be a problem. So probably wanna stick with PPCs. And just hopefully don't get in close range. You know, be, be the best idea. I'm gonna hit a arty strike on them. Looks like they're going this way here. Oh, this is gorgeous. Okay, let's see if we can actually go and do this now. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Nice, nice, nice. Which I did overheat though, but it was targeting me, so that kind of sucks. So I'm kind of out of the fight a little bit. Oh, this is gorgeous. Come on, come on, come on, come on. This is nice. I'm going to help out my brother here. Brother in arms. I'm going to have to stick out for a little bit. Close in. And go for this marauder here. Got two kills. Try not to uh, get into combat too much. That's eight so far. It looks like we are going to win this, which is nice. I'm going to go back over here. Okay, yeah, the overheating is going to be a problem. There we go. We won. Wow, I am highly impressed with this mech. I'm the only thing I'm worried about is the heat. Good game, good game, everybody. Nice game. Is the heat on this, and uh, we'll be able to go ahead and uh, fix that on the next next one. Two kills, team stats, one thousand one thirty. Old Bob, what did old Bob get? Old Bob got two thirty three, two kills, three twenty eight damage. The heat was my problem, but that's okay. I really love this mech. It's really really nice. Thank you. I will, I will. My next mech will be the next one here, and we'll get to that in just a second. So, so basically, we're talking about. Okay, there we go. So basically, we're talking this mech. Uh, let's see how many mechs we have. One Mad uh, C, no MDD. I don't know what that is here. Mad two, three, four, five. Wow, not bad. Good luck and have fun. And <laughs> here we go. In that case, hi YouTube. You too, Speedy. You too, buddy. It's like, uh, here we go. Okay, so they fixed that there. They got the right side. Four meter pulse lasers, two LRM 10s. Let's go see what it looks like on the outside. Oh, not bad. It's pretty cool. Okay, we'll stagger. Bravo Lance, this is Alex. I'm going to follow the assault in. 
Okay, I'm gonna stagger that. I also got jump jets. That's beautiful. Roger. <clears throat> Let's see here. I got a UCM there. Now, now, now the UCMX do know that you have only 90 instead of 180. So just let you guys know about that. Target acquired. I will stick a little bit back just to go ahead and uh, do uh, shits and giggles to go ahead and um, go missile them. Let's go see what happens here. Airstrike online. Yeah, since I just got this mech, it doesn't really go far. Okay, looks like uh, we got some move it up here. Can't get a lock on him though. There we go. Got locks on him now. A cooldown's not that good. It's only 20%, so it's not too, too bad. It's not good, not bad. It gets there. New target acquired. I will try to get this Arctic Cheetah though. I have a lot of uh, new target acquired. Wolverine's gonna get hit with some missiles. They do have some uh, some anti-missile systems, but that's not. It's gonna run out soon, though, so I'm not too worried about it. I have 900 left, so I'm not too worried. New target acquired. Evan Jaguar is gonna get some. Get some. Got a big enemy presence at Delta Three. Those guys get cap really easily. New target acquired. Wolverine is taking some damage, not much. New target acquired. Timberwolf's gonna go. Let's get the Marauder here, so you can do some damage to him. New target and acquired. again, so could we. Enemy base is being captured. Get the Mauler here if I can. It's like I'm not really doing much with the missiles, but it is kind of put them away. Enemy base is being captured. We'll be doing some damage. He's almost there, though. New target acquired. Enemy base is being captured. This Wolverine's gonna. There we go. Got him. Base is being captured. It looks like our base, their base is going, so that's a good thing. Mauler, I'm going to definitely missile him. I'm going to go this way now. There we go. Okay, their base now. Arctic Cheetah. And I am out there. I'm going to stagger my stuff, though, because I don't have enough. There we go, he's down. This guy next. I think our base is being hit too, guys. We gotta hit theirs now. Base twenty five percent captured. Base is being captured. Enemy base is being captured. Gotta get their base, guys. Come on, come on. 
Now, I probably see a overheating like issue, but I think uh, I think it could be over overwhelmed if I maybe switch out to medium lasers per se. But who knows? I'll check that out later on. Stagger that. Everything's staggered right now. Plus, also I have a beagle opera, beagle active probe on this. It's like we got this one now. Enemy base is being captured. There we go, got him. Beautiful. Good game, guys. Good games. That's on YouTube. Well played. Almost shut him out. <laughs> Very nice, guys. Let's see, we got the score here. 142, two kills, ten assists. Not bad. Team damage, unfortunately, that's gonna happen. Um, wow, not bad at all. Let's go see what my score was. Oh, Bob. 302, two kills, 420 damage, not bad at all. Uh, let's see, 302, I got uh, second, third, I, fourth place. Not bad. Anyways, but that's the uh, the the uh, the D, I believe. Yeah, it's a D. So, and also on the right side, do you see how it had actually showed the two kills? So that's a kill marker. That's beautiful. They put that in. Thank God they're using those. It's amazing. It's amazing. I can't believe it. Okay, looks like River City. And basically, I changed the uh, I changed the loadout to uh, four medium pulse lasers, one LB10X. Change up from the two large pulse lasers. I follow my buddy here. Soldier, right? You should have a plan. Okay, watch the G line, guys. Air strike online. Copy that. Lasers from in the city. Where are they coming from? Center city. Echo Box Delta 4. Roger. Target acquired. Gorgeous looking max man, I'll tell you right now. New target acquired. New target acquired. Warning incoming missile. Love radar derp. <clears throat> New target acquired. New target acquired. 
airstrike online. Hmm. Target destroyed. Need help on the left hand side if we can. Got him. New target acquired. There's one in the bridge on the water coming to far side of the bridge there. Yeah, they're pushing on the far side of the bridge. F5. Not gonna play that game. <clears throat> New target acquired. New target acquired. Right torso critical damage. LB10 destroyed. Lost me LB10. Grab on top of the bridge. Target destroyed. Center torso critical damage. Warning incoming missile. It looks like I can't play that game anymore, so I'm gonna back off and let these guys go in first. There we go, good job, good job, five to three. I'm heading into C5. Target acquired. Like three of them down yeah, the water. Right away. They're going under the bridge. I'm out. Ah! That was a hard one. Go Hopefully, I'm able to get to play again. Warning, incoming missile. Anyways, just to let you know the 5M. Uh, pretty fun mech to play. I, I'm the LB10X. I might change out to large pulse lasers. Kind of get that going. Um, this is uh, just to kind of get a game going. See how this works out. And overall, I would have to say the Marauder is a pretty good mech. It's not bad. I do like the D better than the M. <coughs> That's just my own personal preference. Um, Arctic Cheetah, let's see how this goes. Six to four. And then got some good players going too, so it's working out pretty well. You'd be able to go and get some shots in on them. Uh, King Crab's not too much. That's uh, not good. Not a good thing. It's being hammered. Target destroyed. Yeah, see, seven to four. I think we got it now. The three up here will be able to go ahead and take him out. Uh, get this guy on the right hand side. Stalker is pretty, pretty fresh, so. Yeah, this Warhawk's not doing too good. He should actually. Uh, 
Well, what's going on here? Acquired. Critical damage. Yeah, hammers. Not bad. I have to admit, hammers pretty good. He's a good player. Pretty good player there. New target. Uh, seven to five. Uh oh, it's getting there. Yeah, hammer, not too bad there. Let's go see how these guys are doing, like way over here. Hope these guys concentrate fire on the F on the F five place, and looks like they're not. Yeah, uh, yeah. Oh, seven six. It's getting close. I always like these types of games. They're actually very very close. And uh, eight six. They just have to get in there. Marauder's almost dead. It's almost cored. One more. Ah, nine seven. So it's three to five, or five to three, however you want to go ahead and see it. If you guys push together on one of these guys, be fine. Uh, the hammer, is that hammer? Yeah, that's hammer with the Manchi. Not bad, not a bad little... I have to admit, hammer, hats off to you, dude. Hats off to you. He dishes out the damage like crazy, which is good. Shadowcat's running from there, which is a smart idea. Because then it will, it will direct his fire somewhere else. Ooh, good one, good, good one. Good one, awesome. We won the game. <laughs> Very good. The the Marauder, actually, I have to say, is good nice. Well the only problem is, though, good playing, guys. Good playing. Hammer, good game, too. H4MM3R. You're a very good player. Let's see what we got here. And uh, old Bob, 172, one kill, 239. Didn't do too well as the other ones, but I do like this. See how that is, right? Oh, that's beautiful. Let's go back to match and go ahead and, go ahead and give a final like, review about this. <clears throat> I have to say, though, basically it took an hour for me to just to get that one match. So that kind of sucks. <laughs> see here. Okay, so good. Uh, I would have to say that the... Marauder 3R, it's not bad. I have to upgrade some things, do and go different, um, upgrade the engine so I actually um, can actually add more heat sinks. The D is fun to play because I do have some missiles on it. I have two LRM10s and then uh, two um, large pulse lasers, not bad. And then the M, not bad, not bad design. I do have to admit, but um, I have to say also for the R, I'm going to take out that um, that AC10 that I had on there and probably replace it with that LB10X. I like that a lot better than the other one, and plus it fires faster because they have a module for it. But overall, though, I have to say, good, good designs, good mechs, not bad. The paint scheme is kind of cool. I like that paint scheme, and this one here too. The quirks are not are good for for this if you're playing a dual PPC one. This is good for any missiles, and this is good just overall, like generally like a, a laser mech or a laser vomit mech because it does have five energy two ballistic it has it has on the left arm two on the right arm three the 5d has um, the LRMs on the right on right tor on the left yeah, on the left torso sorry and then the two and two on the arms and then this one which is a has the uh, two ER PPCs one two and then two like um, it has two energy two energy and the three ballistic, I believe, is in the torso. So, not a bad design. Have to admit, PGI, good. Cannot wait for the Warhammer that's come out. I really appreciate you watching. Um, makes me feel good I don't talk to myself, for one. And also, too, um, you know, you guys are what makes this game great. Uh, thank you for watching. I know you can watch other YouTubers, and thank you for watching mine. Sorry about my voice. My voice is kind of there. I've been talking a lot. But, hey, thank you, and definitely enjoy the review I just did, and, you, and I'll see you on the battlefield. Okay.